Hi, let's answer this question. What would be the expected shorthand electron configuration for sulfur? Keep in mind that when you write shorthand configurations, the first thing you need to do is write the symbol for the noble gas that precedes the element you're interested in. Then you'd add the remaining electrons by starting at the s orbital of the row that the element is in until the configuration is complete. Take a few seconds to consider your answer. Okay, let's go ahead and solve this question. Sulfur, as you can see, is in the third period of the periodic table, and the noble gas that precedes sulfur is neon. So the first thing we would write is neon in brackets. And keep in mind that neon represents 10 electrons, and sulfur has a total of 16 electrons, so we need six more electrons to complete the configuration. We go to the next level, or the, actually the level where sulfur is, and that's the third level. So we go to the 3s sublevel as the first place we put in electrons after we fill in or we write neon. We put a total of two electrons there because right now we don't have enough. We're only at 12. And again, we need to get to 16. The next sublevel we go to is the 3p sublevel. And because, again, we're trying to get to 16, we presently have 12, we put a total of four electrons into the 3p sublevel. And that would give us a total of 16. 10 for neon, 2 in the 3s, and 4 in the 3p gives us a total of 16 electrons. And that would represent the correct shorthand configuration for sulfur. So the answer in this case is letter choice D, neon 3s2, 3p4.